Salam and welcome back to the island of visual arts. My name is Visha and it's the month of Ramadan. So first of all, Ramadan Mubarak to everyone. Today, let's make an awesome Ramadan Mubarak photo manipulation. You know, we are halfway into Ramadan. Maybe I should make this into a Eid Mubarak post. Anyways, I have a bunch of uh, photos that I got from Envato Elements. I bought a subscription for the first time. And if you guys want me to do a review on that, uh, like explaining uh, if it is better than free stock websites like Unsplash or Pexels, uh, let me know in the comments and I'll make a separate video for that. Also make sure to watch uh, this video where I made a utopian flying city only using free stock images and my own images taken from my phone. Okay, let's begin. Okay, so I started off uh, by making a concept draft sketch. It looked something like this. I know it looks amazing. So what the idea um, in my mind was um, there's going to be a tree house on the side of a mountain and there's going to be a masjid or a mosque on a mountain far in the background. And there's going to be uh, uh, like two kids on the roof of the tree house watching the moon or uh, the northern lights or lanterns or something. Anyways, uh, that's the idea. Let's get to it. So I brought all the images one by one into Photoshop and used basic cutout techniques like quick selection, select by marquee tool and one other uh, selection method that I used for the first time that is sky selection. I gotta say this is a really awesome method. Um, all I have to do is click select and sky and Photoshop will analyze what the sky is on my image and make a selection accurately I would say. And then add a layer mask, uh, do some refinements here and there uh, using the brush tool. Cutting out all the images was uh, definitely not fun, but I wanted to see if my composition can come together. And that is why I kept the color correction part for later. Okay, so I removed this part of the branch to make it less distracting and to make the tree uh, a bit more simpler. And then use the clone stamp tool to sort of fill out uh, the parts that are empty. Then I use the same mountain stock image uh, element to create the uphill part of the mountain. This is to make it um, consistent and so that I don't have to uh, do a lot of color correction later on. The mosque I got from Envato Elements. This is a mosque that is located in Russia. It looks perfect for my composition uh, because it looks Putting highlights and shadows using adjustment layers is definitely not a new technique. If you want some in-depth step-by-step tutorial on that, uh, check out my
Okay, so I realized uh, there should be a way for these kids to climb up there easily, right? So I thought, how about adding a rope ladder? And I started searching for um, a rope ladder on Envato Elements and I couldn't find it there. I tried on Splash as well, but couldn't find there either. So I decided to make my own rope ladder and started looking for rope images. Now this is where Envato came short, but Unsplash delivered. to live wish that i can be somebody that can live just like you did and now that i know